do you think of the highway patrol group taking over ESA? Well, so far it's been quite good. I mean, I like the idea of getting some kind of a higher authority into EDSA to just try and flex some muscle because it's already shown in the few days, okay, there has been mixed reports, but overall nobody's disagreeing with the fact that discipline is actually helping relieve traffic. So if we can do that, there's nothing bad that can come out of that. So guys, do your share by helping these guys do their job and uh, just, just following the rules. We don't need to bring out the military yet, even though that was a radical plan of mine. Let's not bring it to that stage where we get the National Guard out there telling us how to drive, because I think that's really, it's embarrassing, don't you think? What do you think of the government's new rule of allowing cars with four passengers for EDSA? I don't think it's the first thing I would work on. I mean, you know, I see the, I see the logic behind it and the logic behind carpooling, but we have to come up with something that's a little bit sensible in the real world as far as enforcement's concerned. I mean, remember, you're going to have to strip cars of tint. You're going to have to put enforcers out. And these enforcers trying to enforce the very rule might actually create more traffic by doing so. So while I agree in principle with car sharing, there are other easier ways to do this. And more importantly, there are other things that to do first before we get to that stage. So yes, I mean, it's, it's, it's up there with the solution, but not on my top 10.